p.m. and this is the first time I'm leaving the building today. It has been windy. Go community day. We feel kind of embarrassed. Butcher, get in the video. We get kind of embarrassed when we're walking around and like visibly playing Pokemon Go. But it's crazy, like how many anything. people we can like tell that are playing, and how many people have like. Little... Okay, I can't explain it because I am assuming like nobody watching actually plays. But you can put like lures on the Pokestops and more Pokemon <laughs> come around. There's like a lure on every spot, so I know. Every bitch around here is playing. Ooh. I don't want to take a vlog for too long because I'm missing Catching Pokemon that Pokemon. could be could be coming. So thanks for watching. So we found Ooh. a new pot of campus playing Ooh. Pokemon Go. Who would have thought? It's so nice. It's so green and pretty. And now we want to come here and study. <laughs> discovering all this new stuff from pokemon go okay so we had we both had econ over here but we haven't like seen this view of the outside of the business school and look at this this is so nice so this is the back of the stadium dude this is cool there's koi fish <laughs> oh. there's this whole little thing in this giant ass fountain i feel like so dumb like we're in the second quarter, I've never been over here. No, no. You're scaring me. I'm st I'm turning this off. Hello. <sighs> I'm stressed out. There's a lot on my mind. And it's ironic because earlier I was super happy. I look horrible right now. I was so happy. Like, the happiest I've been in so long, and I was just thinking, like, ah, oh, it's so nice to, like, feel like this. And just, it's crazy how fast my mood just changes, and I can just feel, like, depressed for, like, no reason. So I was just doing health homework, and ironically, learning all about stress was making me more stressed, because it was talking about the more stressed you are, the more likely you are to, like, develop onset, like, Pro like chronic problems and diseases and disorders and it was like stressing me out more because I'm like I get so stressed and I can't even like help it even if there's like not really much to stress about I don't know there's a lot on my mind right now and it's already like 10 o'clock and I wanted to go to the gym because I'm trying to go every day and I just don't have time and like I could go but I haven't eaten a lot today for the holiday Martin Luther King Jr. day tomorrow everything is closed but for some reason now everything is closed there's not even like that much stress in my life it's just like ah like this is what like depression like I just literally the past three nights like I just like literally just reading I just like started crying and like Fletcher's there for me and I'm so grateful for that but it's just like a lot like it's it's just a lot. I just want to talk about mental health in college for a second because I don't know. I don't know how long I can actually talk about this for because there's just like a lot going on right now and I feel like I'm a mess inside but it's okay to talk about your mental health and acknowledge if it's not at what you want it to be and acknowledge going to therapy or taking antidepressants because it's a totally normal thing and I have been reading a lot about stress for health class which I feel like it's a very important class and I'm learning a lot even though I just said it's kind of stressing me out further reading about how stress is affecting me because it feels like it's just kind of like a mental thing but I kind of don't think about all the physical aspects of it. I feel like I don't have a lot of physical school stressors like it's kind of temporary 
but it's kind of there's like a lingering stress and depression that keeps getting increasingly worse it's healthy to acknowledge it and talk about it and probably a lot of people are in college and experiencing the same thing and you're not alone because I'm here. I seem good a lot of the time as I've talked about before and I am a lot of the time and it comes and goes and it's just, it can just come out of nowhere and nothing can be wrong. And kind of like today, like it was a good day and doing my health homework is really not a stressful thing. It's not super time consuming. It's pretty easy. It's just reading and a quick quiz, but sometimes th things can just, stress you out more than they should. I felt like I was getting better as I kept talking about it more and now I'm just kind of like in my head about it a lot. So I'm gonna go get some food because I haven't eaten in like 10 hours. No, it hasn't been, has it? I ate at like 12.30 or one and it's like 10. Okay, it's been like nine hours. Oh my God. Okay, I'm gonna go. <laughs> so thanks for listening. What's up, Say hey, cars. Hey. Jails. Hey. <laughs> what's subway? I don't know what time it is. Can you say what's up, way? What's up, way? <laughs> and this sandwich is probably the best thing I've ever had. Yum. And this is the what first time I've ever gotten a foot long sandwich and eaten all of it. So. <laughs> Happy Tuesday. I got a shoddy. Oh my god, it looks like I have horrible wrinkles. I frozen yogurt. Mine. Um, I didn't really have any chocolate sauce or anything chocolate at all, except for Nutella, and it didn't really come out well, so that's mine. Good morning, everybody. I just wanted to vlog about the happiest news that's happened ever. My English class is canceled. It's 8.24 and class starts at 10.10. I have been up since like 7 working <laughs> on this crit close reading interpretive something assignment. Last night I didn't work on it because I was helping Fudger with his speech for comms. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, I have an hour and a half to like finish this, which I was going to, but I also have like two other like small things to do for english and i have to shower and i'm like so tired this is like the best thing that's happened because i was just like what are the odds like this one day i have like so much to do i'm gonna, I'm gonna go straight back to sleep like he just emailed like three minutes ago like i'm sorry i'm sick i'm gonna have to cancel class steven thank you so much i'm so sorry you're sick but you just made my day oh i hate when i'm just like this is college, thank you. Hello, I've been in such a good mood all day. Ever since class was canceled, it's kind of sad. I have class in about 10-ish minutes now. Putting on a little bit of makeup and I was eating some oatmeal, which is my breakfast slash lunch. Feeling good, I like went back to sleep and I feel like so well rested now. Cause even though I got like seven hours of sleep last night, I just have so much sleep debt. It's like, I can't make it up. So Fletcher is still asleep and I need to go wake him up before class. <laughs>
I've been taking selfies for like 10 minutes now and I have a speech in comms tomorrow which is my communication class so the class is literally just giving speeches and I have my first one tomorrow and I haven't finished writing it and my class is at 7 a.m. and I need to practice it a lot I hope you enjoyed this little dance while I was speaking also I am in love with slash want to be Lily Chi. She is probably the most gorgeous person that I have ever seen. Time for my speech. Yay! Yay! 9 a.m. Just gave my speech in comms. I think it went pretty well. I don't know. I have a video of myself because someone had to record us. So I'm kind of dreading watching that because I don't really want to see myself public speaking. I think I'm gonna make some oatmeal and maybe watch The Bachelor because I'm behind. So this is probably gonna look awful on camera, but look at the sunset. It's crazy. It's just like a thick ass pink line. So we're in the second quarter and we actually got something that we've never gotten before. We both got bowls, two taco. Not gonna lie, they're kind of good. I'm kind of liking all the flavors. The chicken's actually really good, comparable to a bowl at Chipotle, maybe. I don't know, because I've never got one, but... Butcher, <laughs> what do you think? So, right now, I'm walking down to the pack to pick up Kinga. If you guys have watched my earlier vlogs, she is one of my best friends from home, and she's visiting the baddest bitch alive! Oh my God, I'm vlogging! So Aww. Aww. 